Hi uh, everyone, uh, this is uh, Dr. Surya Kiran Nawad. Uh, we are hosting an uh, international conference on A and ML uh, in Dallas, uh, Texas. I did my PhD in uh, organ chemistry and uh, have a like you know uh, 25 years of experience. And uh, I authored several uh, publications, books, and patents. Um, I published it to like you now over 100 uh, publications. Uh, today, actually, we are going. Uh, we are conducting a, 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 a workshop uh, conference, international conference, uh, in Dallas, Texas, on uh, artificial intelligence and uh, machine learning. Um, so, I'm really excited about you know the various speakers uh, talked about their expertise and uh, the different areas of their expertise, especially like uh, <laughs> AI. Uh, in current trends, AI in uh, uh, supply chain, and uh, what uh, and data science basics, and uh, financial um, uh, CFO, a lot of topics covered, and uh, it's a very uh, uh, excited. And uh, this is uh, an annual conference, and we are going to conduct uh, this con uh, conference uh, every year, and uh, as a part of uh, Cyphers publications. So the Cyphers publications, we are celebrating our 10th anniversary in this occasion, like we are conducting this conference. And uh, so we started this publication company uh, because of the, uh, you know, so uh, various uh, aspects, like, you know, uh, giving the opportunity to publish their pub uh, articles, um, researchers' articles uh, in, in uh, you know, open access platform. Oh, it's been great. It's uh, nice to be here with all the uh, people kind of at the edge of technology and learning about machine learning. Yeah, I presented, I'm a consumer of AI, and um, so I presented my role as a CFO and, uh, and how I could utilize machine learning and AI in my role as a CFO, helping the customers that I help. My talk was uh, my my talk was initially about my role as a CFO with strategic planning, uh, forecasting and budgeting, uh, accuracy of financials, <clears throat> a little bit about my background, uh, some healthcare. I've, I've I've spent you know the last twenty years in healthcare, and how AI and machine learning can can be involved in that industry. I was really interested in uh, <clears throat> the guy that presented right before me. He talked about robotics and how how the neural network of, of say, for example, myself can be connected to the ro robot who can be thinking about what I'm thinking about what I need to get done. So the robot can go out and get all of that done while I'm thinking about it, while I'm just drinking my coffee. <laughs> I think the technology, as we embrace that technology, is going to make our jobs a lot easier. It's going to improve conditions. I think as we begin to em embrace this technology and learn how to use it, it's going to make life and or make us much more efficient, more productive as a society. Yeah, it was uh, great to see entrepreneurs out there trying to solve problems and using the current technology that we have and kind of looking out into the future and they're really right on the frontier. The other presenter talked about uh, the uh, Cyforce, Cyf which is a, uh, a, a publication company where people can publish their articles and get peer review. And it was interesting to see all of the, our, our, it was interesting to see how that process came together and I've I've known Kieran for a long time and he's come a long way getting his his uh, that company up and running and lots of recognition from around the world it was really good thanks for inviting me to give a, a lecture um, for the conference uh, AI and machine learning program uh, I have delivered my lecture today uh, it went well and I see a lot of audience uh, present and they come up with uh, the number of questions about uh, uh, current uh, AI and machine learning um, capabilities and what are the challenges um, in the real world. And we also discuss about the different um, uh, areas where the AI can be 
uh, applicable and uh, the challenges that we have in current uh, scenarios. And we also discussed on future roadmaps uh, for the, uh, uh, in the area of AI. Uh, there are many uh, uh, audience, they're showing in enthusiasm. I'm happy to be here uh, to, uh, for the lecture that I given. I hope uh, the uh, audience enjoy my uh, information and we share the uh, information. So <clears throat> as a part of uh, decision making and uh, data driven and decision making, uh, we are here to uh, capturize all the developments in the current trends using AI and machine learning. And we also discuss about the what are the uh, potential outcomes and what are the challenges uh, pertaining to the cloud technology, where the AI is playing a vital role. Mm, we also see, you know, the current roadmaps uh, for the next generation, what could be the uh, next addition to the current uh, chat GPT-3 or chat GPT-4, or we can, uh, we can say the open source um, that's, uh, uh, that we have um, you know, the currently in the market. Um, I hope like uh, we added the insights and the, I hope audience likes uh, the insights and the gathered information um, and uh, recent publications uh, with the Cyforce. Uh, I hope um, audience can get the information from here and they will um, get the knowledge out of it. Uh, thank you. Hi, uh, this is Krishna Dilmita. I'm being here for the Sci-Fi and uh, you know, Artificial Intelligence and Machine Learning Conference. And this is a great opportunity for to learn with all my co-members. And uh, this conference is being discussed, you know, a lot of opportunities on the upcoming AI and machine learning area, especially, you know, what are the potential, um, you know, issues we have in current organization, especially in relations to the sales and marketing strategy. And uh, some of the challenges we are facing, you know, facing in the current uh, data issues, etc. And uh, you know, uh, this is a great opportunity to discuss uh, those kind of gaps. Um, and one of the interesting fact is, you know, this conference has given uh, a roadmap for the next ten years. Exactly, you know, what AI ML is going to be revolutionize, um, you know, some of the um, you know data models, and uh, you know, um, what are the different technologies. Uh, the role which is going to play uh, in an everyday organization, you know, uh, roles and responsibilities uh, to perform uh, specific tasks. And um, I think this is a great opportunity, um, you know, uh, for uh, especially startup companies like us, uh, you know, we involved as a Cerro Alto Digital, as a digital innovation company. And we have a very good takeaway from this conference. And we contributed this, uh, you know, uh, this conference today uh, which gives a lot of information, uh, a lot of takeaways uh, for this conference. And thank you for giving this opportunity and appreciate it. Hey, good evening, everyone. Uh, we are here and uh, glad to you know be a part of this conference to know about the latest happening on AI and uh, ML. You know, especially pertaining to supply chain and then manufacturing. And hear from the great leaders. It's really a good opportunity. We are learning things and uh, we are happy to look forward. Yeah, hi, Dallas lo AIML conference are written in Telisi, watch him. And uh, very nice conference, Baga organization, Cyforce company, publications. Wala. And various topics made the other presentations, very nice presentations going on, lot of knowledge. And future on the AI may the depend on the uh, expertise of business intelligence. Me the, so, AI in business intelligence, the AI integrated to another medoc china presentation. Nasa in Chi shares this. Good presentation overall, going good, and looking forward for more uh, conferences like this. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, this is Satya Sukumar. I'm uh, part of uh, editorial team uh, Cyforce Publications. Uh, we are really here, uh, part of uh, Cyforce Publications. Excited. Uh, to support the research and academic uh, initiatives that are happening. I am here uh, today to present my uh, future thesis that I am currently working on COVID-19 uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning uh, detection models. So I had uh, presented a research paper and uh, the current research paper uh, and the future scope of the research is being uh, discussed. As part of this uh, set of conferences give a lot of uh, uh, information for the future scope of research. 
and uh, it helps everybody to build uh, the innovative uh, technologies to understand a uh, lot more uh, in details of uh, what's happening in terms of research, learning versus training versus uh, the real uh, building uh, uh, research platforms as well. Hi, this is Suresh. First of all, thanks to Cyforce for organizing such a wonderful event. Um, and thanks to all the speakers and for sharing their experiences, intelligence, research. Um, uh, all the, um, all the speak, uh, speakers presented uh, their backgrounds about AI, how it is influencing the world uh, and the industry. Um, so uh, such a really um, wonderful sharing thoughts and uh, information. Um, this is really helpful for me to learning uh, A and ML, uh, how it is evolving in the world, uh, how it is taking over the world and how it is impacting uh, uh, human lives. Um, uh, it's a really wonderful experience um, uh, learning all aspects of AML. And uh, this is definitely uh, useful. I'm looking forward to uh, this kind of events uh, in future. Um, uh, I encourage you to join everyone uh, in future conferences like this. Yeah, hi Andy, Nabir Balakamesh. So here uh, today, I uh, technology conference which you know, it's uh, based on artificial intelligence and cloud computing. So basically, you know, CVS Health work in the domain of uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning. So uh, it's good to participate in this kind of uh, technical conferences. First, uh, this is my first conference as I'm going to be a presenter over here. So, so Salaman de Pardaka, much, much topics present this year exactly. Industry at wealth on the AA Meda and the Pantaman de Jepte. Industry lay AA and the Opeo Bortundi, Allah Opeo Bortundi, Rosa and Elkota Chapran Jarindi. So, yeah, it's a good experience for me to participate in this kind of thing in our Dallas, yeah, especially. So, I came from India, so I can choose, but I can go to Ilantivi, Andro, Manavalandro, Kelpi Gadra, Ilantivi. Participation is a month's vision. Thanks, Andy. My name is Dr. Surini Oshun. Today I, I attended this conference. So I presented the topic uh, A integration with supply chain management. So also uh, a lot of participants uh, presented in different streams. So it's a very useful session. And uh, today I enjoyed the conference. So all the very best. Uh, so I am eager to attend uh, further conferences. Thank you. My name is Surinder Kandagatla. So, uh, I mean, uh, I attended this conference like, uh, uh, I mean, it's a more informatic uh, information and uh, I really like enjoyed the, the conference and uh, I mean, the topics which are related to AI. So, uh, machine learning, I think uh, current uh, trending topic, right? So, I think, uh, uh, I mean, uh, I'm really good session this one so I really enjoy it. Hi my name is Viresh uh, and uh, today we attended a uh, uh, international conference uh, on artificial intelligence and machine learning. Uh, we discussed, uh, we explored so many topics here into different fields uh, and we discussed about the what are the advantages and disadvantages of the artificial intelligence and machine learning. Uh, also everybody explored their knowledge uh, in, in different fields like shipping domains uh, and education department and Mars and the earth. Uh, what are the basic advantages we are going to do? What are the major changes we can see in the future um, using the artificial intelligence? Uh, in the in the different different environment so today i presented about my topic customer support system how can we improve the customer support system in the current tradition compared to in the future we can get rid of all the issues in the present system and we can improve a lot of things in the art in the future using the artificial intelligence hi uh, this is tulsi kala from dallas uh, i think today this all the AI and ml session was went very well uh, and we learn a lot of things and the, the all the presenters give the lot of information. So I think the the AI and ML is the next revolutionary things going on and a lot of tremendous changes going on in the world. Uh, the most important point is uh, we need to utilize the AI in a right way uh, because and we need to people more proactive on the regulation side. I think the 
the chat gpt is is more powerful tool but we need to utilize the uh, the ai tools in a proper way so instead of using it the wrong way right so and people also the kids especially use the uh, ai tools for learning but don't uh, use that the other uh, purpose the uh, thing that's the reason most people are need to use the ai tools in a right way in a right direction